Hello and welcome, this is Sahara playing another episode of Legends of Isenwald. And we just went through a um, heroic battle with um, like about five horsemen and we beat their butts! We did have a little damage, but um, now, I need, now I need to find my way back to where I needed to go. Oop, here we go. We still have some more fighting I need to heal up because my um, healer woman got... She was knocked unconscious. No. So I need to find... I get so confused with these way these roads go. I think it's this way. Yep. Yep, yep, it is. And I know there's a church here. Long Meadow. I believe the church is up here. Yes, it is. Right there. Okay. We're going to heal. All right. So I did equip some more. He got a better, um, because there was a little bit of equipment that came with, um, oh, the best thing for him is I got a fabulous horse out of that deal for my nobleman. So he gets 22 plus health, 11 initiative, 3 melee attack, 2 melee defense, and 2 range defense. Cool. How cool is that? And I got better lance for him too. And then um, he was able to take this. And then one of them got a better shield. Yes. So we're getting better and stronger. Alright. So since I'm here, I'm going to go ahead and report this to the King of the Wolves. Whatever you want to call him. Okay. So talk with Gusto Falk. Tell about Adam's murder. This knit of lint had to be squashed. Well, it's probably this knit of. Okay, he asked that as a question. This knit of lint had to be squashed. Well, it's probably for the better. Okay, so we're gonna leave. And I don't think we have any more here. These are probably just gonna say goodbye. They just happened to be there in the building at the time. Goodbye. Oh, I forgot I could heal here too. All right, so I am up to my nine. All right, next to my hire is going to be a nobleman. Another one. I do like them. But there's so, there's things to be said about the guards and stuff, too. All right, so now we need to convince the rest of... So this one is... Um, oh, that should be gone. Because I've already done that. You can relay your success to the master of the wolves, which I just did, right? Hmm... Uh, maybe I have to finish this other one too. So now I need to three citizens, and I already got Adam. Um, so now I have to do the other two. There's one down here. I already did Adam, so I got to do this one over here. This is from Carmina. I can never say the name. Carmina, I guess, is what it, how it's called. All right, he is in the town of Carmina. Am I going the right way? I believe I am. Yep, because that's Windfield. Cremina goes this way. I wonder if I'm strong enough to take on those knights now with that golden horn. I thought this was where I was supposed to go. Well, I guess not. I went the wrong way. Again. Again, again, I went the wrong way. Hmm. There was that um, thing about the sand cap. You'll hear a noise. If you're, yeah, whatever. Okay, so I must have went, I need to go over here, I guess. Where the hell am I at? No, I'm getting there. I just keep going. Yep, here we go. I just missed the road. That's all. He looks like he's skating. He's going so fast. <laughs> all right, here we go.
So, um, ah, yes, it was Peter Wink, wasn't it? Who's this Rainer von Tronhelm? Okay, any more rumors? No. So you're here by the order of Sir Gustav Belk, right? I'll gladly give you audience. Ah uh, yes, my promise. Don't worry, I'm quite scrupulous in business affairs. According to our deal, I have to deliver some goods to Wolfschnitz. Wolfschnitz. You can take them directly, as I have everything from the list. Tap tapestries from Eras, jewelry from Auberstein, silk from Venice, wines from Burgundy. And take a look at this. I can't help but boast a little. A special order Gustav Falk has asked for. A beautiful object, is it not? A dagger with a red gold handle in the shape of a wolf's head. None of the local masters would be able to make one like that. It has traveled here all the way from Samarquani. Samarquani? I admit, for all of Gustav Falk's talk of modesty and con contemporary luxury, one can't admire such double standards, that's for sure. Okay, so I got what I was supposed to get. And Edwin who didn't want to pay his debt. Okay, Peter Wink gave you all the goods. He owed the order. Hand the goods over to Master Falk. Oh, that's right, because I told him about Adam. I didn't tell him about the other one. Okay, that's my mistake. So, so I have to go clear over here, which is fine. So let's just go ahead. Can I get in this way now? I don't think I can. Hmm. Hey, I just got him a better one. Ooh, that one's 1500 though. I just don't have it. Oh, he can do a better pipe though. Because this is... He's got an evasion on this one. Why did they say this one is more? Price, I, I don't get it. I do not get it sometimes how they do this. This is a better pike. It costs more. Hmm. Oh, does he have anything for horses here? Oh, yes. He needs a saddle and a bridle. Um... So this would go here, so it's either this or that. Balance. I think balance is pretty good on a horse, hmm? Alright, um... Anything else over here I can use? Nope. How about them? Oh, didn't I have one of these ones? Did I sell it though? I don't know. I mean, she can use... They, I know they had, at one time, they had... Urgh. I'm gonna give her this one. She keeps getting whaled on. How can this be better? What about him? Can he... Oh, he can use that. He can use that, and he can use this. Okay. I... I want, this is minus three lay... Minus three melee attack and minus... 20% initiative? I... Oh, because this is, but you can, so this is minus 40% initiative. God, I just don't, I just don't see why they say it's better. Hmm. Oh, no, 
now he can wear this. He couldn't wear it before. Okay. Sometimes when you shuffle stuff around, suddenly they can wear things that they couldn't before. I don't know. I think it all depends on the weight, like I said before. Okay, enough to green around here. Oh, oh, ooh, what is this? She, can she get one of those? No, how can about him? But she can. So this is a staff. And seven, okay. That goes there. Nope, I'm sorry, it goes here. There we go. Okay, well, how come this one's still saying it's better? I don't know. I just don't get it. You buy one and then it says, no, and then I buy it now it says it's not. Oh, well, she'll probably use it sometime along the road or he will. Um, okay, let's just get out of this place. So there's no way to get over here to the, hmm, all right, so I got to go all the way around no matter what I do. Lots of walking around. I can then get some tribute from there while I'm over there. This is where I need to go. I know I've been here one time, I think. The Church of St. John the Baptist, that's right. You can heal, you can buy. Here again, oh, okay. Now, how about her? Mm. I just bought her that new one. But she is has all right it's worth it for the initiative okay can he use that yes he can is that better yes and what's this um armor a glove not about her that's another staff I'm going to have to think about that. Okay, at least now I know where to go to get it. We need to go fight. We need some action. I know my castle isn't far from here. I think it's up this way, isn't it? Isn't it? I see something in red just showed up. Oh. Here we go. Now you can hear horses. Okay, so where I need to go at is right down. Oop, there's somebody coming up behind me. Am I going away from them or, away, or are they coming away from me? Look, here we go. Somebody's coming up to me. Where are you at? Oh, you're up over there. Yep, there it is. Mountain Brittle captured your building watchtower. All right.
All right, let's do, what can she do now? Gift of a unit under attack on this spell immediately gets an extra turn every time he gains health from spells or potions. The effect lasts three turns under this effect. So I don't get to, okay. I don't know what that means. Come on. <laughs> um, bigger. I'm just checking these spells out. Oh, instead. Let's go to this one. Excuse me. has that poisoned weapon. That's why that happens. Alright, let's get rid of these damn archers. Alright, you need to heal him. Let's heal him too. Get rid of him. Rush should flee, and they did. They surrendered. So where I need to go was down here. Mm. Oop, there's somebody else moving around. It looks like the very stone the peasant told me about. Oh, really? I found it? On the bottom of the lake lies Calvin Helmuth of, oh my goodness, who was deceived by his eyes and his heart. Trust neither your eyes nor your soul, but your mind, and may it always be as cold as the stone. That's sad. There was somebody ba bad down here moving around, so I'm going after him. Hmm. Oh, they disappeared. Okay, so I need to find that building that was flashing at me. It's down here, wasn't it? Oh, that's my watchtower. I probably got stolen again. Okay, so I just need to keep going south. I think the watchtower is down here, though. It is. I think. Wasn't it? Being close to it. Yep, here we go. It was hostile, now it's not. Alright, I must be getting close to where I'm supposed to be. Alright, come on, where are you at? Oh, it's clear up there, I gotta get... Gotta go this way. I know, I remember this little manor. There it is, right there. Oop, somebody popped up behind me. Oh, 
I will come to you later. But you can take my watchtower again? You are, aren't you? Where are you at? There you are. Okay, we pinned you now. We're going to get you. These bad people just run all over, don't they? They run everywhere. Going to get you. Here we are. Gotcha. These guys are no match. <laughs> nope. Come on. you out of there. Yep. Surrendered. Not really worth it, but I mean it's every little bit of experience helps. We gotta get him out of here anyway. Alright. I'm missing my whole mission, aren't I? It's supposed to be down here. Oops, I'm on the wrong way again. I like the fighting. I like the combat. I don't know what to tell you. I know why people play these games. Is the fighting okay? Come on, where is it at? All right, it's it's. Up here on, oh, it's just down from my castle. That's right, I forgot about that. Okay, so let's go back up this way. It's just down from my castle. It's the mansion. Hidden up in the woods. It's this thing here, I think. So it looks like. Yep, meeting Marcus the Armorer. We can heal a little bit. Oh, how unexpected, frankly speaking. I wasn't expecting you so soon. It seems the greedy wolf will not let me be, so I have no other choice. No other choice? What do you mean? This beast demanded me to forge and set one of his men beside this beast demanded me to forge and set one of his men beside me with knife in hand. He ordered a rare and exotic weapon which I doubt I'll ever manage to craft. In the case that I ha that I fail to fulfill my side of the deal, I am to give my daughter to him. He sent you to take her, but you won't get her. I hit her well, so even if you cut me into pieces you still won't learn where she is. Hmm. No, father, you mustn't sacrifice all our family has saved. 
Sylvia, what are you doing here? I ordered you to... It's all God's will, Father. Pray for me. I'll go with you, mercenary. Well, I'm feeling bad about this. Really? <sighs> so, everything was a farce. Do I really want to be part of him? Uh, I mean... <sighs> As it turned out, Gustafon has forced an un... An unfulfillable deal upon Marcus to armor her. Now Marcus has to surrender his daughter. Silva has it as a servant. She will probably be held in as a concubine. You have to escort her to the master of the wolves. Oh my goodness. Okay. I wanted to be a part of the Red Wolf, but I certainly, under I certainly understand that you do not care about me, but they say Falk treats his concubines quite badly. You are not one of his servants, so why do you mar your soil soul with such a deed as this? What can I do? If I do not do it, as your father said, he will simply send another. But you can try to fill my father's promise. If you deliver the rare item to Falk, the old beast will have to admit that the deal is done, and it will be, and I'll be able to return home. Okay, I warn you, you won't get anything more for this, and it may be he will be less pleased for allowing this the woman to escape his gnarled fingers. So how do I get this item? Okay. You can help Sylvie to avoid her sad fate if you get the weapon that Marcus was supposed to deliver to. This is a rare and unusual or ornamental sword called Cora. And where do I find this Cora? Hmm. That's interesting. I have no idea where to find this Cora at. Well, um, well, since I'm on this side, Okay, let's go down here and talk to Eagle's Nest and see what they want. Since I'm here. Eagle's Nest. Hmm. Yeah, I'm I'm think I'm liking less and less more of the Red Order. They let themselves get too big. And then they ex they expect a tribute from people for what? For because they don't because they claim they don't have any um all right, it's because they claim they have no um <laughs> no lands or possessions, but yet they demand other people give their work to them. I'm not liking that at all. Not liking that at all. So Eagle's Nest should be. To be getting close to it. Jacob's Manor. Did you feel well? That's another castle, but it isn't one I want. Guard. So how close am I to it? I think I went the wrong way. Yes, I did. I need to go up. Up, 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 up. It's called Eagle's Nest for a reason, I suppose. Is this it? I don't think it is. No, it's up here. I don't want to go in there. There's another quarry. 
Where is it? It's up here. Okay, so I gotta go this way. Come on. Oh, here it is. It was a big building right here. Duh. Ursula. Greetings, traveler. What interest do you have at Eagle's Nest? You don't look like a merchant. Then again, merchants can differ. My name is Karen von Lonsten. I'm a wandering noblewoman. I have come on behalf of the Duke with a mission from Chancellor Werner to help you to guard the peace and welfare in Pitchin. There now, the old trickster Chancellor has sent me a maiden as a present. I wonder what kind of payment he will ask of you later. However, first I need to see what you're really worth. You may enter my chambers. Okay. For discussion, yes. Anything else is off the table. Yeah, we don't have sex with women. <laughs> For discussion, yes. All right. Um, let's talk to him first. Have anything to tell me? No, beard. Uh, oh, well, you look I'm uh, like really dashing. <coughs> Yeah, that is an ugly, ugly outfit. But then, yeah, it makes sense because she, they're all dressed for her. My ears are open, Corinne. Um, how, okay. Ask Ursula about the fate of the du duchy. Well, I just realized, um, okay, I'm just going to go up fast through this because I just realized we're 31 minutes. So I'm going to go ahead and... End this episode now before I get into all this dialogue. Dialogue. So if you enjoyed this episode, click like, leave a comment, and thank you for watching. And I'm sorry I kind of wandered around a bit this episode just chasing down bad guys because they shouldn't be there. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> yeah. thank you for watching Sahara out.